Hello, hello, hello. It is I, James. This story, as you can tell by the title, is just kind of a more personal one. Um, it's just kind of being a homeless YouTuber. What's it like? Are there any extra considerations that I may have to make that you don't? Well, first off, it's tough. And it's tough because you don't get to meet the goals that you want to meet. And I'm not talking about like views or subs or anything. I'm just talking about your image, like the image you have of yourself. For example, a lot of you don't know, but I'm a VTuber now. <laughs> My sock puppet's digital. I'm a VTuber. Um, I thought about this having my digital sock puppet years ago. This is a years old idea. And the personality Ricky was made up. This funny voice I was supposed to use. Which I don't know. Um, I had like this really fun kind of like episodic thing I wanted to edit where it's kind of like space ghost coast to coast. I had this whole plan, man, where I'd use like comments on my channel and just do this fun kind of interactive show once a month or once a week or something. Like I had all these great plans, but the thing is homeless. So here's one, just the shelter, you know, um, my internet sucks. I pay for my own internet, but the cables in this building are very old. So the basic package I pay for is 300 MBS and it gets tested. I, I get, I think a max of 150 or like 125, something like that. My internet's trash. There's nothing I can do about it. It's just the building. Um, making voices and talking loud is really embarrassing, you know? Um, sometimes I get concerned, you know? During a stream, once someone was all jacked up on something and they locked themselves out of their room and, you know, knocking on my door during the stream because they hear me talking, being awake. So, like, projecting my voice, you know, makes me nervous. And to do a voice, you like a funny voice, you have to project your voice, right? Like, if you talk like this, everyone's going to think you're lame. But that's just one example. Um, money, right? I'm broke, so upgrades come really slow. Like, it takes forever to upgrade my stuff. Forever. Uh, time. You know, you think life would be easy because I'm a man of few possessions now and everything I own is in this crappy gypsy room, but no, I, I lose stuff constantly. I'm somehow disheveled. It's, it does something to your morale. <laughs> it's not easy. It's also not easy because, you know, I post on places like Reddit once in a while, and I, I, I get a less than lukewarm reaction when people find out that I'm homeless. They're, they're pretty much like, you loser, why are you even trying? I've, I've even had people say to me verbatim, like, art's a privilege that shouldn't be afforded to the homeless. So it's tough. It's tough in a lot of different areas. And I'm not telling you this for sympathy. Our excuses, it's just... Some cold, hard facts real quick. Um, I've said this a few times, and I'm going to say it again. I'm, I'm really grateful. May 23rd this year, I had 18 subs, and now I have 224. The thing is, I've been losing some. And I've been losing some because it's hard to keep to my commitments. You know? And that's really the point of this video. I'm telling you. It's a thorn in your side being homeless. As a side note, I know this video is kind of scuffed, but again, I've been up for like over 24 hours. It's hard to sleep here. And I have to work a whole shift later today. <laughs> I can just tell, you know, like the tone of this video is already like complaining and nobody likes that. I'm not trying to, I'm just, I'm trying to relate this. Um, no, I'm not giving up or anything. I'm not done making story videos. I'm not abandoning the book idea. I'm not done with the PNG stuff. I'm not done with the idea of doing like an e in real life live stream you know it just it takes forever what i'm trying to say is any type of evolution takes me forever you know i i don't have the resources i don't have the knowledge i don't i don't have the skills i mean to get my sock puppet avatar i've had to use chat gpt and i'm really grateful for chat gpt but that was a process that wasn't easy. 
and like it took all of my brain power to to do something like give it a single emote you know um just to do, do basic rigging is just brain surgery it's so difficult for me um I'm trying to say for everybody that hasn't unsubscribed, thank you. I, I know, like, rooting for somebody in my position, it's probably, like, can be tough on a viewer. Like, you guys want to see me do well, you know? And you know I'm doing well based off of um, these videos, most of you. And I don't end up making these videos because I'm trying to put so much effort into, like, evolving this channel, into getting my editing to, like, be more than basic, you know, to go from a literal sock on my hand to a PNG and now to a VTuber. It's, I'm so proud of myself, man, but compared to other VTubers, my everything is like a centimeter of progress to them. And I, I know that. And I know some people think this just looks chaotic, you know, like, is he trying to be a channel who does social commentary? Is he trying to, like, make money off being homeless? Is he, you know, is he a VTuber? What is he? And to that, I don't know, man. But do you need to know either? Like, what's wrong with just being myself? But therein lies the problem, you know? <laughs> because I spend energy to upgrade something. And I have limited time. And very, you know, I have very limited time. And... Basically, this is the story this week. I'm not doing a page two of the Legend, <laughs> Legend of Greenleaf this week. I'm going to do that stuff next week. Just thanks for being a sub to the channel. Thanks for sticking around. I know some people, I think they unsub because it looks like maybe the channel is dying because I don't like make a video for a week and they don't see these like they don't see the progress and personally if you ask me going from a sock puppet all the way up to VTuber is like huge progress man that's huge but I'm starting from zero so even if I make a lot of progress you guys aren't going to notice for a minute you know it's 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 going to happen behind the scenes and I mean, when it does happen, it's not like it's going to be revolutionary, you know? It's not like I can post on Reddit, hey, I'm a, I'm a sock puppet VTuber. <laughs> no one cares, you know? Um, what am I trying to say? I, I'm, I'm not trying to be negative. I'm just so tired. Um, I, I'm really sorry to be the YouTuber who's breaking promises and saying that I'm going to do something for the week and not doing it. It is such a challenge meeting deadlines and upgrading. I'm going to get to the point where I can do both, though. I, I'm absolutely going to. And This is going to be a pain to edit because I don't even know what I'm trying to say in this video anymore. I'm just that tired. Um, there is no Friday story this week. There is no Legend of Green Leaf page too. I need more time. I need more time. But I would like to say this. If you're somehow still watching this mess of a video of a guy who hasn't slept, and there's no way this is entertaining. I, this is really just for subscribers. Um, I'm really not trying to have you believe in me to let you down. I am doing things behind the scenes. It takes a minute to see it, you know? I, I still want to use Ricky the Sock Puppet but in, like, funny ways. I still want to do, like, an internet show. It's, you know, none of it's going to happen tomorrow. But it's also going to happen quicker than you think. I am giving it my all, and I have brain damage. And though I have no great technical skill or ability, I'm worth something. And when I put my mind 100% towards something... And which it is, I am sprinting towards whatever this vague goal is and away from addiction, you know? I, 
this is my version of sprinting. It just probably doesn't look like it. Just thanks for believing in me. Thanks for watching, and thanks for staying subscribed. Um, I know some people are probably unsubscribing because it seems like I'm just another YouTuber who's like, hey, guys, watch me on my journey to not be homeless, and it seems like I'm making promises to make videos and just being a failure, but I'm really just asking you to see that I am making a lot of progress, and I'm making so much progress that like my ship's like shaking through the atmosphere, and even though I'm getting no sleep, I'm, I'm, I'm pushing through this. I am pushing through this. So please wait, and hopefully next week I can start having, and it might take a couple weeks. It might be a month. Like, it might be until, like, winter, until, like, I'm a really reliable YouTuber of any sort, you know? And I know people watch me for different reasons. People like different content, and they don't, not everybody, like, cross-watches. Like, I know for a fact that the people who watch my videos, most of them don't even know that I stream, you know? And so that's, it's just, I'm getting there. I'm getting there, and thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for staying subscribed and believing in me. It means a lot. It really, really does. You know, I'm passionate about this. And I know my progress is, it's pathetic compared to what most YouTubers could do. But uh, that's where I'm at in life. And it makes me really happy. I just... I'm asking that you don't see this inconsistency in me saying I'm going to come out with a video and failing to meet that date, because it is a failure. I'm just asking that you don't hold it against me and um, keep believing in me. If you can see the progress that I've made for what it is, you can see that And that's it. I I don't even have the energy to <laughs> shoot this 29 times and get a coherent story. I just, I'm sorry that I'm not going to meet my deadlines outside of streaming this week. I'm not going to. But, um, look, from Sock Puppet to BNG to, lot, to VTuber, my videos and my editing are going to make those jumps too. You know, just... Give me a chance here. Thanks for watching.